here in June of 1940, trooped in here and got onto trains and been sent off. I don't think they even knew where they were going. And Eddie Izzard's dad was one of those children who was evacuated from Bexhill Station during the Second World War, aged just 12. Most of us had never spent a night away from home. And uh, so it was a great adventure and we didn't know how it's going to work out. The children came back on the trains in time for Christmas and to commemorate his dad's 90th birthday, Eddie commissioned this model railway marking his return. So this is the Bexhill Winter Wartime Model Railway. All the sounds you can hear are real. Bombed out houses here. Heavy snow greeted the children who came home and Eddie wanted this to be a portrayal of what his dad would have experienced in wartime Bexhill. So we've got a downed Heinkel, we've got a downed uh, Spitfire. Um, these are things that actually happened. From the barbed wire on the beach to the bombers heard flying overhead. The attention to detail and the personal touches are amazing. The older woman is representing my great-grandmother, dad's grandmother, and she died seven days before he, he got home on Christmas. So he never gave her a Christmas present. So I said, Dad, there'll be a little image of you giving a present over to your grandmother, which you never got to do. But that'll live on forever, just there. And Eddie's passion for trains started very early and became very important to the family. So Mum died when, when we were only... I was six, my brother was seven, just going on eight. And uh, it was obviously a bit, a bit of a devastating thing. It was totally devastating to the family. And Dad encouraged us to get more into the railway. The idea, I think, was the railway would help us after Mum died. This is the train set he built with his brother as a little boy and donated to the Bexhill Museum. The beautiful thing of this is it's, it, it was really part of us and now it's, it'll stay here for, for Bexhill for kids to play with, kids old and young. <laughs> These sets bring history to life full of memories for Eddie's family, made all the more poignant as his dad never saw the one dedicated to him. Lucy Cotter, Sky News.